what was the day of the week on 28 may 2006 here up to 1600 years there are zero odd day and in 400 years there are zero odd day which means you can directly write up to 2000 years there are zero odd day now find out the odd days in remaining years here the sixth year is not a complete year this year is only up to 28 may which means remaining years are five years in five years there is only one leap year and four non leap year to find out the leap year in a year divide the year with four it will give you number of leap year here in five years there is only one leap year now leap year means two odd days so one into two non leap year means only one odd day so two plus four is six six odd day now remaining is up to 28 may that is january 2006 to 28 may now up to 28 may means in january there are 31 days february 2006 means non leap year so 28 days march 31 april 30 may 31 but may is only up to 28 so 28 now in 31 3 odd days 28 0 odd day 31 3 odd day 30 2 odd day 28 0 odd day total 3 plus 3 plus 2 is 8 8 by 7 will give you reminder 1 so 1 odd day now you can see here in 5 years there are 6 odd day and up to 28 may 1 odd day so 6 plus 1 is 7 so 7 by 7 give you reminder 0 which means here if you consider first day as sunday then sunday plus 0 will give you sunday which means 28 may 2006 is sunday option a is your answer whenever the first day is not mentioned take first day as sunday next is what was the day of the week on 16 july 1776 here up to 1600 zero odd days and remaining means 176 years but this last year is only up to 16 july not a complete year so remaining 175 years 175 years i will split it as 100 years plus 75 years in 100 years there are five odd days in 75 years 75 by 4 will give you 18 leap years that is in 75 years there are 18 leap year and remaining 57 non leap year 18 leap year means 18 into 2 36 odd days 57 non leap year means 57 into 1 57 odd days which means total 93 odd days 93 odd days means 93 by 7 will give you reminder 2 odd days in 93 days there are 2 odd days so here 5 odd day here 2 odd day remaining up to 16 july so up to 16 july means in january 31 days february this 1776 is divisible by 4 which means it is a leap year now february 29 days march 31 april 30 may 31 june 30 july up to 16 now old days in 31 is 3 old days in 29 1 in 31 3 old days 30 2 old days 31 3 old days 30 2 old days 16 2 old days total 3 plus 3 plus 1 cancel 2 plus 3 plus 2 cancel remaining 2 odd day so here also 2 odd day total 5 plus 2 cancel remaining 2 odd day 2 odd days means Sunday plus 2 will give you Tuesday so option A is your answer